Mm-hmm. Okay. But yes, we they were they were Yoshi's back then, but definitely they, they were not much. Nowhere. <laughs> on but does AMSA have the ice climber experience? Is the question. I think I can imagine he does. I I want to say I remember seeing a couple of ice climbers in the videos in Japan. I want to say Yoshi has the tools to deal with this as long as he doesn't really commit to a ground game. Obviously, if he gets on the ground, it's so bad because his shield, everybody says Yoshi's shield is so bad. It's different. But the thing is, once he gets caught in the egg, oh, man. I mean, there's not a lot of pressure that an ice climber can really do, but it's just a simple fact that you really don't want to get grabbed. In his, I'm hoping these are hand warmers. I'm hoping we're not really going to FD for the first stage because I would. Okay, I was gonna question how that happened in the strike. It's like I understand you, Japan, rough. and I understand you guys love your FD. Please, not that much. The the scary thing about ice climbers, though, is when you look at any like top ice climber player, they're placed out so drastically yes. different. Oh, so yes. you really never know what to expect when you fight an ice climber, uh, unless you've played that specific player a lot recently. So. Um, Chu is not one to shy away from using all of their tools, being some of the, the originator of many of Ice Climber's techniques. Mm -hmm. So he may not have the, the perfect execution that Wobbles has or the uh, beautiful chain grab combos that Fly and Manita has, but he is definitely more than a solid Ice Climber in his own right. Oh, yeah. Uh, so I'm very curious to see. Uh, exactly how both these players approach the matchup because this is not a matchup I've seen very I, often. Yeah, I was just thinking it's like, you know, as much as I want to try and act like I know what is probably going to happen, I can't really pretend like I've seen this one before. Not yeah. not at this level. Yeah, and it, it, it throws into question, can Yoshi really parry like their double attacks? Like, I don't really think he can, right? Like, uh, unless they're they're so closely spaced together, which I they never really are. I think so. he, I think you'd have to resort to a lot more uh, double jump cancels or yeah. double jump armor. Excuse me. Yep. Um, and guess what? We're uh, we're about to learn on the fly whether we like it or not. Yeah. This is. This is. Whew. She's resetting his controller. Apex 2014. Cool. Brought to you by our wonderful sponsors over at Play Asia. And twenty locators, go over there and like the, yo money guys money. Just go like. Attorney Locator. You want to you want to try to donate money for Amsa's <laughs> pot? Go like the Attorney Locator. Amsa's your favorite today? I wouldn't put him as my favorite, but I would not be surprised if he somehow like. I could see him top eight if, I he, if he wins this match. I can see him top eight. I can see him top eight. I don't. I don't see him winning. I would not be surprised if it somehow happened. Though. Yeah. The 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 big top five man they're they're so strong versus the weaker characters Mewtwo King Mango PP H Fox they're so strong oh yeah versus I mean it's just it's just scary it's daunting really for any character but I think here we go um I'm scared for Hamza because it's a thief but it looks like here we go yep ooh all right it looks like we're getting a peek into his strategy right now. Egg, egg chew, body nana. That's the strategy. But Let's that's, go with it. That's the problem, though. Oh. Ice climbers can solo chain grab Yoshi. <laughs> yes, please, Dio. Oh! Yes. <laughs> chew, chew, dropping the knowledge real quick. That That is one thing I do remember about this. But again, how often do you really see it? So how strong is it? I didn't entirely know. <laughs> yeah, a solo mm -hmm. popo is very dangerous. All right, it looks like he goes very high, though, at over, like, 75%. So it, yeah. it doesn't seem like Chu can uh, do very much. And let's see what Amsa can do to finish off the stock. Ooh. A little slow on that. That's okay. We got the follow up. Good down smash. And he was waiting for it. Oh, at least he didn't DI the first two down smashes, so it's really good that he DI that one. That's the stock? Oh, he knows he's the up there. So close. No DI there either. And he's going to have to work on his uh, defensive survivability if he wants to take this, these 1v1 battles versus Sopo because Sopo's. Oh. <laughs> Whoop! <laughs> one, of his, one of Sopo's main tools is wave dash down smash. So if you don't. The item properly, you can find your stocks ending very quickly. All right. And another note: we look like four grabs, about 20. I'll just say 29 to keep it easy, since that's what we saw. 
too, going for the old school throw combos. Yes. And just like that, this is looking really rough for Yoshi. I, I gotta be honest, I didn't know Ice Climbers could uh, grab combo Yoshi so well. I mean, I knew like they had wobbling and chain grabs, but just like the ran the regular old school combos. Oh yeah. Ooh, great finish on Nana. Dunk. Let's see if he can get Sopo out of the picture without getting too much percent. Oh. Oh, he's type of Ooh, okay, hip bomber. Good choice. And nice just, parry. Yeah, they're just diving on top of each other. Chew Dad doesn't want to play that game anymore. I don't blame him. Got backed up out of grab range. He's rolling around forward smash. Good looks. And yeah, just has to roll up the list. Yoshi Another very early death uh, due to lack of the eye. Uh, for those of you that don't know, uh, when your character gets hurt, you can hold a certain direction and influence the way your character flies. So if you hold towards the stage, usually at a perpendicular angle to the way you go, uh -huh. you can uh, survive much longer than if you uh, hold away from the stage or don't hold any direction at all. So that's why we call it directional influence, right? Yep, because you influence the direction in which you travel after getting a uh, hit. Ah. So, Hamza mm. finally <laughs> finishes that Soko stock, but he has two whole, technically four ice climbers to kill. <laughs> And I think it's so funny in that last one that uh, I just want to point out that it was cool that he baited out the uh, spot dodge, and because of Yoshi's double jump, he was able to turn around and punish the spot uh, the air dodge. Excuse yep. me. Crazy this of this character. Um, oh, I thought he was gonna. <laughs> that would have been sandwich so wobble him. That would have been <laughs> very epic. Ooh, okay. I see how that works. Okay, for those of you that don't know, Yoshi's down tilt always sends characters at a fixed uh, hit back. Yep. It, regardless of their percent, they always travel the same distance. So I'm just using that to always knock Nana the same distance and effectively uh, just walk up and keep down tilting her until she dies. Now my question is, Amsa keeps looking for uh, neutral B. He keeps looking for the egg grab in, uh, in neutral. I kind of wonder, once Chew That is in the egg, can he input anything to make uh, Nana do anything? I, I'm assuming no, because both the stocks he lost, or both the Nanas he lost, that's how he lost them. Yeah, um, I'm not exactly sure the full mechanics of desyncing, but uh, when Nana's a certain distance away, he can make her attack. Yeah. But... It's uh, it's not as reliable as say like controlling her from neutral, uh, like him sending her forward. But, so, but see the thing is she's not she's not even running. It's not so far from her release that it's forcing her to run in and uh, forcing the computer AI to take over. Yeah. that's why I question it. I think it's because the egg is like above her. She's kind of waiting for Popo to just come back down, Possibly. and then she gets down tilted. Uh, but yeah, it might lock his input so that he can't make her attack. That could be why Ansa's resorting to it so much. Quick 53%. The yeah. game just started. I believe. Ansa took some hammers to the dinosaur nose. Mm. Well, and that's going to be the end of Nana stock. See you, Nana. All right. He's at a percent where the, the throws are not going to bother him too much now. So let's see if he can get this Sopo stock. Uh, even playing a little riskier. That's kind of an awkward hit on the down smash. He didn't, like, go anywhere. Yeah. Yeah, and you can see he's going ooh, almost horizontally every time he gets hit by a down smash. Usually, he'll if he's in the middle of the stage, he'll go like upwards at like a almost an 80 degree angle, not 90, but almost straight upwards. Yes. If he dies it properly, so that's how you can tell that he's a uh, he's not uh, using all his defensive tools that he could use. Good use he, of the back. He really wants to steal the stock. Great. He's been punishing those air dodges so well. Yes. And it's like you don't you don't really have anything you can do. It's either you take the egg and you're stuck in the edge guard or you spot do or you air dodge and here you go, back to the platform. And I'm just actually got the lead. Had the lead. My bad. Great Ooh. save on the damage. But he's just gonna smack her again and just get away from her. <laughs> Hold these purple little booties. <laughs> and that's I don't want to say that's how every Ice Climber matchup dissolves down to, but that's something that's very important is how do you split them up and when you get them separated, how much damage can you do if only killing Nana? Yep. Obviously killing Popo would be the best case scenario, but in a lot of matchups, killing Nana is enough. This yeah. one? And it's also because he can control her like while he's recovering, uh -huh. you're sometimes trying to combo Popo and then you just get like randomly jabbed by Nana <laughs> or like up smashed or something. So it's it's almost better just to always get her out of the way, especially if Popo is at low percents. Uh huh. And uh, a lot of his more 
poorer matchups are, are really just characters that can beat the crap out of Nana huh. without him uh, being able to retaliate like Shines from Fox. Did you see that down throw all smash? I did not, sorry. So you didn't see how uh, Amsa went like literally nowhere from the up smash. I think it was a little bit too He early. might have parried it. He, he was grabbed, that's what I'm saying. Down throw up smash. I couldn't, I looked up, we were talking, I didn't know if he was in the grab or um, I didn't know if he was on the ground or not. See what I'm saying? It was odd. Oh, you're saying Nana up smashed him? Okay, yeah. It might have been a Phantom. Possibly. Let's see if he gets if he gets this is a great lead for him right now. Yeah, it doesn't have to <laughs> He's like, just run over there like a little choo choo train. The Yoshi train. I always love that about Yoshi and Bowser. They both run like like their little train on the track. <laughs> uh oh. Can he get out of this? Can he turn around? Yeah, he's able to mash out, mash out the grab. She couldn't get Nana in rage in time. Egg her. Yeah, she's building she up some damage. Ooh, that down smash is so great. Ice Climbers tend to have an issue with uh, down smashes that hit on both sides because uh -huh. it it lets him force Popo to block, but still hits Nana away and builds up the damage and gives him the opportunity to kill Nana. So that was a good backer to catch the cross with Patel. Ooh, Amsa's getting so much mileage out of that down smash right now. His offense has been so great this game. And see, that's what I was talking about before we started. Once he gets into shield and commits to shielding, it's a, it is scary. Oh, that's all right. Trading in the air. This is on the board. That was a great match for Hansa. So, Chu can't go back to FD. No. And what they, do you think he's going to ban? What do I think he's going to ban? Uh, if you're, I think if you're Yoshi, you ban Pokemon. You don't want to give him those long stages that just kind of let you get thrown. Fair. Oh, doesn't look like he did. Well, because at the same time, I was thinking maybe you kind of want to go there so you have a lot more room to work with. I mean, I've played Chu in tournament before, and he was like, I'm a spacey player. So, and he was like, hey, you want to just play Pokemon? I got baited. I didn't know that was like his favorite stage. With, like, <laughs> so uh, that's just a little player history that I have on Chu. So I knew he would favor this stage if, uh, if he got the opportunity to. So let's see what Answer can do. Can you get the grab combo? There's the blizzard. The down air. Ooh, 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 blizzard. Oh. Up snap. Oh, oh he goes for another one. Reed. Reed will get you every time. Uh, he wasn't sure if Yoshi would die, but Pokemon is a low ceiling, so I think he should have taken the risk. Great DI yeah. by answer there. You see how he went. He didn't leave he didn't even leave the actual stage. Yo, he tried to kidnap her. That's it. She's done. Yeah. She got scooped. <laughs> she got it. She's like, yo, I'm gonna egg throw you. Come here. Go that way. Great forward smash to punish that dash attack. Yep, keeping him in check. Mm. Down smash is so fast, so let's him react perfectly to the fastball right now. A couple of edge cancel eggs making uh, Chu Dan fall back, giving off to the Rudy needs, and we're going to uh, we're going to some platforms. Not going to make it there in time though. Chu evens out the game. Yes. What transformation do we have? Okay, we have one of the more balanced transformations here. Uh, I'm not sure exactly which of these two characters would favor better from transformation. I would guess the Ice Climbers would prefer the more flat stage. Yeah. So this might be in Yoshi's favor if he can use these platforms to his advantage. Ooh, goes for a grab there. A little risky, but not a big punishment. Ooh. Uh -oh. He just tapped left a little bit with his new should be. And that's a heavy price Great to pay. Great DI away. Ooh, but you read it that time. He's like, you're going to hold away to get out of my throw? Hold this forward smash. And so instantly deleted off the screen. <laughs> can he get Nana here? Goes for the down smash. Great. Kills Nana. Nana doesn't do anything except second jump unless Popo is near her to command her. So if she can't reach the stage with her second Ooh. jump, she's going to die. Did you see what just happened? Grab Opsa out of the forward smash. That was brave. That was very brave by Chu. Especially at like 90-something percent. She's getting a lot of mileage out of his down throws right now. Ooh, tries to back air the double jump, but... Uh, Yoshi's double jump does have armor on it. Yes, it does. So if he doesn't act out of it, if he doesn't press any buttons, he, his double jump will just eat your attacks. He'll still take the damage, but he won't receive any knockback. It's a uh, from it's, from a lot of moves, not all of them, but from yeah. a lot of them. Yeah, there's still some moves that go through his armor, but uh, for the most part, he can recover safely. Good wave dash grab. Oh, great roll. Yeah. Great down Yes. Ooh. See, that's that little Yoshi knowledge that Chu probably didn't have, that that up smash. Misses the sweet spot on the ledge and eats the punish. Nana's still alive. Great neutral air. Chu's looking to save her. He's like, oh. 
mana list. Ooh. Better DI than some players have. Stays right on stage. Wow, that. rude. <laughs> so rude. I know what you're getting at. Nice. You got Popo. Side battle. Yo, Last I'm, stock. Yeah, I'm swarming up the crowd. Here we go. Getting back to Boston back here is good down smash. Oh, he went for another neutral B, got his stuff by the ice block. That down tilt is so good when it's phase two, so. Man is dead. Sopo versus Yoshi. Who's gonna take it? Tournament? Well, not winner's tournament. Like, Go, but we back. Cancel. Ooh, so tense. Oh, another okay. media cancel. Chu, holding on for dear life. Just trying to get back on the stage. What does he have from this? He doesn't have anything from that. Nope. The grab's not too important right now. He's got to watch the shield because the shield stab, the shield stab forward air is going to end him. Yep. Oh. oh, down smash. Yes. And Amsa takes it. Wow. You hear the crowd erupt. Oh, great play by Amsa. Yes. And that was, that was such a great adaptation from the first match. He got kind of bodied in the first match. Kind of bodied? <laughs> <laughs> and.